Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Mario Golf Coastal Tour playthrough. I'm happy because, well, two reasons. Uh, for one, we are doing the last character match for match play. So we'll be done with uh, this mode of play after today's video. And uh, two, we're using a character who has way more impact and control. Or at least more so than this character right here. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, we're going to be using Bowser Jr. today. You know, it doesn't have the farthest distance, but uh, still hits it pretty far. Has a straight shot. Has kind of a lower elevation shot. And our opponent will, of course, be his mighty father, who has a very, very large draw. A middle elevation. But uh, we'll see if we can uh, we'll see if we can take him down. And of course, we're going to do this on their home turf, if I can pick the right uh, mode of play here. Uh, we're going to go to the home turf of the Bowser Badlands. <laughs> I'm so good. Golfing is starting to get boring. Boring! Well, we'll see about that, Pops. Okay, Bowser Badlands we go. And we're going to start very far back this time, because remember, we're using the uh, back tees. We're not using the front tees. And the front tees are like... There, I guess? Yeah, the front tees are like to the left of where we are. We're like in a little fortress, but... We're going to hit it right. I could hit a full shot, but I don't think I'll just hit it right here. Not that I have to worry about accuracy as much, since I'm not playing as PD Piranha, but still. This is a course where you do want to have, like, you know, some accuracy um, at your disposal, because of just the hard nature of this course. Ooh, that's going to be in the deep rough. Or just normal rough. It, it looked like it was going to be in the deep rough. But it was normal. It was normal. Okay, good shot by... Bowju. That's short for Bowser Jr., if you couldn't tell. Maybe I'll just call him Jr. <laughs> Bowju seems a little obsessive. The Bows and Junior, yeah. Okay. Nice shot. Thankfully, Bowser had some issues on this hole, so I should be able to get the victory here. Nice shot. Almost Inside. chipped it right in. To win. I also love his blue putter. <laughs> That's a cute blue putter that uh, Junior has. Maybe it's kind of like in reference to his uh, Shadow Mario disguise and everything. Okay, let's, uh, well I can't do some taunts yet. I have to wait till it's Papa's turn to hit. Okay, no, I'm not gonna do that. Not really sure where to aim here though. I'm going to try doing this. I'm going to try hitting a little softer. I'm a little nervous about this. I think the uh, dock will bounce it if I hit it. Well, I didn't bounce on the dock, but I'm, I'm still in the fairway. That's all that matters. Bowser did what I was wanting to do, but I think he's got a ways to go. Actually, he's closer than I am, despite me hitting the lo longer shot. Okay, so we do have uh, wind. That should still be pretty good, especially with the backspin. Kind of a weird bounce I got from that, but it might be fun. <laughs> Did you just say baby shot? <laughs> I kind of want to see that again. Nice shot. Okay, 
good, good approach from the bows. Good approach. Nice shot. And good approach from me too. Okay, well, it's a tie better than him getting a point. Okay, let's go. Next one. Right, this hole. Oh man, you can't really even aim for that one island over there. should be good. That should be in the fairway and overlooking my next direction. Also, the fast fairway kind of helped there, too. So I am alright with that. Okay. Do I want to go there or do I want to go... Ooh. Well, I can hit it up there. Honestly, I'm not even hating the prospect, because that's... Yeah, let's go for it. Perfect. Oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful shot. Beautiful. And no matter what... Yeah, I think Bowser's going to go for this little island over here. And like I think it's because he's the CPU AI, he's not going to aim for the green, uh, is he? No, he is aiming for it, okay. He, he actually was pretty aggressive on this one, and it is going to work out. Thankfully I was pretty aggressive too, and I'm closer, so... I was just more aggressive with my first and second shot. Bowser was aggressive with his third shot and paid off for him. Okay. The par three. Oh, this one. I don't really like where the wind is either on this one, if I'm being honest. Okay, let me do this. That should, in theory, be good, but we'll see. I didn't want to get that close to the bob on though. Kind of hoping the booze would have slowed Bowser down there, but well, he didn't get on the green, so that's fun. Uh, let's see. Kind of a tricky putt. It's kind of downhill. Uh, that should be fun. Don't chip it in. Don't chip it in. Don't chip it in. Okay, good. Yes! Okay. I have a chance to take this hole. Give me that. Give me that hole! Come on, Bowser. Be a good example to your son, you know? Show him that you're proud of him. Give him a hug. Bowser's a good father, though. Best video game dad. Sorry, Kratos, but... And I'm talking about God of War Kratos.
like doing like top spin right here but I mean it's a three wood so it's still gonna bounce pretty far I'll still give it a shot Ooh, accuracy no bad accuracy bad bad it's gonna go in the heath or heath or whatever I don't care um Like completely. Nice shot. Nice shot. Chip in. Okay, good. Nice nice <laughs> I'm glad I was able to like end it with a tie at least. Tied chip in at that. Uh, okay. Nah. Um, I thought about doing some crazy stuff, but then I'm like, you know, maybe I shouldn't. Although this is looking pretty crazy as it is. I'm hoping that accuracy kind of... Yep, that's kind of what I was hoping. I think I'm in a good position, too, where I shouldn't be in range of the thwomps, either. I think he's going to use the uh, fast fairway to get up to the green. Not quite, but still. The attempt was there. Uh, we got uh, some backwind. We got some bad accuracy. Ugh. Still made it on the green fringe, though. A little further away than what I wanted to be, but hey. It's an opportunity at the very least. Uh, looks like it goes kind of uphill at the very end, but it also goes kind of downhill too, so... Probably... That's probably too hard. Or just enough. That works. Junior has to have his statue too, you know. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, that's very perfect. That's probably the best par three I've had in a while. I've been kind of mixed on these last couple of par threes and these last couple of videos. Uh, let's see, we have straight shots. Got rain, so we're gonna hit it a little harder. So I'm three up, we're about to go to the back nine. He doesn't have any points, so I mean the more ties we get, the less medals I'll need. This is definitely going like miles better than the last game. <laughs> And now we're at This is a Volcano. Nice shot. I don't know why I always have to make that reference. I think it was just because, like, 
I played this game quite a bit in college, and college was also kind of like the YouTube poop era, at least for me anyway. W w wait, hold on. What? What is he doing? Nice shot. You guys are seeing this, right? Like, is he... What? <laughs> He's just doing the same thing again. <laughs> this is eighth shot. Is he throwing? Like, is he throwing this right now? I don't get it. <laughs> is the AI just not sure how to handle this set of circumstances for this hole? Like, he, he's, he's going to have to time out here. <laughs> this is his last shot, I think. Or maybe it's the next shot is his last one. Like, he's going to have to give up. I don't know why... He, I don't know what he's trying to do. Like, maybe he thinks there's, like, a secret warp to the hole, but... Okay, well, I, I, I guess I won that hole. Uh... I've never seen the AI do that before. I mean, we've seen the AI do some dumb stuff, like, especially on this course. AI Birdo didn't exactly do too well on a few of these holes either, but... AI Birdo didn't do that. That's actually a really good... Yeah, nice. Okay, this is like... <sighs> I'm flabbergasted. And that's not a word I use often. I like the word flabbergasted, but... The amount of times it comes up in my daily vocabulary is pretty much none. But for something like this, or that... I think I can make a damn exception for it. Nice shot. Nice on. I think Bowser just wants his son to nice win. <laughs> I think that's what it is. Oh, that's a really good shot, but again, like I'm, I got here one stroke earlier, so I'm gonna just take it. We are five strokes ahead, three more medals to win, heading to the back nine. This will be a lot shorter than the last video. The last video was long. Um, I don't even know if I want to do this. I gotta remember, he's not PD Piranha. Uh, just stay out of the bunker, please. Wow, way to do exactly the opposite of what I wanted. Nice I think if I would have got full power, I probably would have avoided that bunker. Bowser's... No, that's a different bunker. <laughs> but he skipped over that other bunker, though, so... Bowser may actually get a point here, due to the rubber banding. Uh, let's see. This is a bad shot, by the way. 
I'm gonna do this. Hold on, it may not be over yet. Bowser's not even on the green yet. Nice shot. I almost chipped that in though. Uh, what's my putt like? It's pretty straight. Little downhill and to the right, or heading from the right. That should be good enough. Or not. Okay, well, Bowser gets a hole, but. After the nonsense that was that one par five on hole eight, I don't mind playing an extra hole because that was just kind of like a weird, weird, weird happenstance. And that's not a word I use often, happenstance. Kind of like the word flabbergasted, actually, when you think about it. What the hell am I talking about? I don't know. Okay. I'm not sure where this is going to go. Ugh. Well, my par 3 progress is kind of... biting the dirt. I love this Bowser animation. He does those like three little like light roars and then he just does the big roar. Okay, the wall the wall o spikes. Nice shot. Maybe maybe Bowser messing up that one hole, maybe that was just like his plan. The <laughs> his plan to throw me off. Put me in a false sense of security, and now he's just gonna like play extremely well for the rest of this game. I think that's exactly what we're dealing with now. Nice shot. And let me just say, I've had a very weird day so far. Um, I mean, I recorded the previous video right before this, so that was already, like, a very stressful game. But, um... Had one of those moments where I was sleeping. As, as one normally does. But you have one of those dreams, and it's not really a good or bad dream, but, like... All of a sudden, in the dream... You have that experience where it's like you start to fall, and you fall from a height, like, elevation, basically. And then, like, I'm already someone who's kind of, like... When I'm in video games, it doesn't bother me because it's, it's a video game. I don't really care. But, like, I am someone who, in real life, is actually quite scared of heights. I'm not someone who gets scared, like, in an airplane or anything like that, but, like... You know, if I'm just out in the open and I'm, like, really high up, it kind of, like, puts me in an uncomfortable situation, basically. And, basically, in the dream, I fell. And mid-fall, I wake up. <laughs> and, of course, when that happens, like, you know, you're still trying to separate, you know, dream from reality and everything. Sweat was like pouring down my head and my pillow was getting soaked. And I would just uh, I just felt so so freaking uncomfortable. It's uh, that's how I woke up this morning and then I got a shower, I'm like, well let me get this recording done, I have to record today, and then the last game happened and then this game with Bowser doing <laughs> that <laughs> thing that he did. That also happened. So yeah, it's been, been kind of a weird day. Can't say it's been a bad day, though, at least. So that's something, I guess. 
don't like this fence. I'm just gonna play it safe, play over here. Yeah, let's see, that seems pretty good. Exactly where I wanted to be. Nice shot. Ooh, nice, nice shot by Bowser. Hey, he, he did better here than the last par five. <laughs> I don't know if I should have did backspin there. Oh no, that was good. Probably for the best. Get in there. Yes. Okay. Sorry, Bowser. You're not gonna redeem yourself on this par five. I like the way his eyes were kind of like glaring before the the screen switched. <laughs> okay. One more medal. Okay. Just need to get one more win, and we're good. And this, this is the hole that I actually kind of generally do well in, so. I have the advantage. So I'm gonna try I'm gonna try something. I know this might seem kinda weird, but I'm gonna aim for the top path on this rock and see if I can bounce over everything. Nice shot. If I fall in the like hole or whatever, that's fine. Oh, I'm actually on the upper fairway. Cool. Was not expecting that, but here we are. As long as I get on the green right here, I should be fine. Oh, that's perfect. I, ugh, I don't know what happened there. I got too excited. Ah, that was my bad. Damn! I could have rolled in. Damn accuracy again. I think I can putt from here, though. Can, but... good putt too. Yeah, I I messed that up. I was ready to get that sh second shot, but then like I just got a little too antsy and I just hit that way too hard. It's okay. So even e even though I had like a pretty big dominating front nine experience. Well, okay, the game's over now because Bowser did that, but even though I had a dominating front nine experience, Bowser did win a couple of holes on the back nine. And I keep getting really bad accuracy shots. I need to just calm down. I, I, I have the game. <laughs> the game's pretty much on lock as long as I don't play stupid. Heck, Bowser may even decide to throw again. I don't know. Yeah, if anyone has any idea about, about like Bowser's like AI patterns in that instance earlier, because I know there have been a couple of people who, like, I know there's like someone who like speed runs this game who's been watching this playthrough, and some other people who just know a lot about this game. 
Like, even though I love this game too, I haven't like studied the game that deep. So if anyone has an idea of like what Bowser was trying to do there, that just like wasn't working for some reason, I would be interested in like knowing that. <laughs> Because that was pretty... I've never seen anything like that before. I've seen them, like, make, like, very weird shots, like, that are only go, like, a few yards to get in a better position. And that's what I kind of feel like he was trying to do, but, like, couldn't make it work just due to the nature of that hole. We got it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are done with uh, Bowser Badlands and uh, yeah it, it was a it was a playthrough I guess <laughs> uh, wow well we have the star character for Bowser and we've officially unlocked all of the star characters now So, looking at the bows himself, we have 290 yards. Have that heavy fade. He has a little bit more impact than Petey does. A lot more spin, though, too. He also has a better elevation. Well, better, I guess, is subjective. But, yeah. There we go. That is um, all the characters. All the characters have been starred. And that'll also do it for this weekend of Mario Golf. And um, I guess next weekend, I guess we're going to start doing the star tournaments. Now, I would like to use the uh, um, hidden characters again uh, for the uh, star tournaments. So even though we've used like a lot of the hidden characters recently, we'll probably see them again. Um, I'm going to try to use Petey Piranha and Boo as soon as possible, though, because ugh, dealing with their accuracy was just not fun in the least bit. But, uh, yeah, we'll uh, start working on the Star Tournaments next time. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Later, folks. <laughs>